Yo, this is the Scar City Studios YouTube channel. Please don't forget to like, comment, share and subscribe. And our sponsors are Alpha Claims and Hire Birmingham, the leading and best accident management company. Get a replacement car anywhere in one hour. I really appreciate you joining me again today. And this is some more news coming from London. At Snaresbrook Crown Court on Thursday the 4th of February, three men have been jailed for over 20 years for their role in the seizure of £6 million worth of cocaine. This is totally separate to the story we did the other day that has nearly got 60,000 views on the channel when police seized £60,000 worth of cocaine from couriers in Scotland. This one happened near Essex. Lazarus Lazides from Essex was sentenced to 11 years. Joe Sawyer from Redbridge was sentenced to 8 years. And Robert Beckley from Kent was sentenced to 4 years and 4 months. The court heard that on the 6th of October 2020, Lazides was seen parking in a van outside the home of Sawyer. Before getting into Sawyer's vehicle with a blue holdall, he put this holdall in the back seats before they drove off. At approximately 10 past 3, Sawyer returned and got in the rear of the van with a holdall. He left the van before returning to the vehicle and driving home. Nearly an hour and a half later, Beckley arrived in a black van and parked in Field House Close. Sawyer saw him pull up moved the white van up the road and parked three cars in front of Beckley. With everything in place, Sawyer paced up and down the road on the phone to Lazides, who arrived in a black car shortly after. With Lazides now present, Sawyer got out the blue holder and went to the front passenger seat of Beckley's van, handing over the blue bag. Beckley then left and in his vehicle he was followed by officers down the M25 where he was stopped by marked police cars. The blue holder was still in the passenger footwell. Inside, they found five kilos of cocaine. Back at Fieldhouse Close, Lazides was seen by officers taking two Sports Direct bags out of the black car and the second vehicle that he arrived in. They appeared to be much bigger than the first one and very heavy to carry. He put both bags in the rear of the white van that he initially arrived in and then left. Officers followed him and arrested him at 7 o'clock in North London. Upon his arrest, he was found to be in possession of a large quantity of money and a burner phone. Under one of the rear seats was a sophisticated hideout that the police discovered. Officers searched Lazide's address where they found three kilos of cocaine with cash totaling over 55 grand, a number of expensive watches and receipts for Harrods. Sawyer was arrested 45 minutes after Lazide's arrest. Officers found the keys to the white van that Lazide had initially arrived in and opened it. Inside they found two Sports Direct bags and inside the bags were 24 one kilo bricks of cocaine. The second bag was now empty and underneath the floor in the rear of the vehicle and this was another hideout that contained another 17 kilos of cocaine. Overall 41 kilos were found in the back of the van alone and in total 49 kilos were seized in the operation which had a street value of £6 million. All of the men were charged on the 6th of November 2020 with conspiracy to supply Class A drugs and Lazides was charged with possession of criminal property in relation to the money that was seized. So I feel like this shows that during lockdown it made people a lot more obvious and but the, at the same time they don't explain why they actually got onto them. So this may have been some undercover operation that had been ongoing for quite a while. And there is also no mention for once of EncroChat. But we've got some EncroChat news coming up in the next episode. So I'd really like to hear what people have to say on this story and go and check out our previous video on the Scottish seizure of 59 kilos as well and see the sentences in comparison to this one. I really want to hear what people have to say on this story. Please don't forget to like, comment, share and subscribe. I'll be back again very shortly with some more news. Peace.